Today we're going to talk about our favorite lenses under 100 quid. Let's go! We know that many people are obsessed with pixel peeping, sharpness and vignetting. However, what I look for a lens is character. And their imperfections are which give lenses its character and make images unique. In fact, I'm always trying to remove digital sharpness nowadays since everything looks so sharp that it looks like TV. Also, when we film a video, our image is usually cropped, so vignetting is not really a problem for us. You know, some people will tell you, hey, you need to invest in proper cinema lenses, expensive ones to make cinematic content, otherwise you will never have cinematic videos, whatever. Your talent and your skill will make you a better filmmaker, and these things will only improve if you practice. And you will practice more if you have affordable gear now, than if you have to wait 5 years to buy the perfect lens and camera, which, by the way, do not exist. This said, let's see your favorite lenses for filmmaking under 100 quid. The first one is this Nikon 28mm 2.8. We love this lens and it can be found in eBay for around 100 quid. It's a lens from the 70s and I love the image and color it produces, killing that digital sharpness I'm always trying to avoid. Its focal length is very versatile. You can get wide shots, but you can also get closer to your talent and get some medium and close up shots. Getting closer to your talent instead of using a tele lens will give you a sense of three dimensionality and being in the scene, which will make your shots more cinematic. The manual focus ring is a joy to use, and if you're not obsessed with bokeh, 2.8 is a perfect aperture to go. So try to frame and light your shots properly instead of relying on things out of focus all the time. Don't be lazy. The other good thing is that you can find them 50mm from the same series at almost the same price. It will give you the same color rendition, so if you are using both lenses, your grading will be easier to do. Another lens we like is Make 35mm 1.7. We got this for the Fuji system and Micro Four Thirds, we were surprised by its quality. The lens has a lot of character and so small that it's perfect for run and gun situations or go unnoticed in events or documentaries. Paired with the Fuji, it looks you are using a vintage camera. The focus ring is a bit stiff, but it gets better with the use. For its price, it's hard to be beaten. And 35mm is a nice focal length to go out there and film. Our third favorite lens is a classic. The Canon 50mm 1.8. Yeah, that classic piece of plastic that was good to our Canons years ago. This lens is cheap, but similar to their bigger sisters in image quality. It can be used in full-frame cameras and also adapted to APCS and Micro Four Thirds, of course. It's a bit softer when wide open, but it has creamy look that we love. Also, Jose won some prizes back in the days, so he has a special love for this lens. The only thing to have into account is that the focus ring is a nightmare for manual focus, so it's better to use autofocus. And that's it guys, these are our 3 favorite lenses under 100 quid. Anyway, you have different options like Helios, Minolta, Canons, etc. Don't be afraid of using all lenses, do some research online and enjoy. Film and get better at what you love. Like if you like it and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. I will see you guys next time.